hello guys welcome to my kitchen today is day three on our daniel fast and we are going to have our awesome recipe but before then we are going to know the bible verses that are used for day three and also a quote from hope through the dark okay so let's get started i made uses of daniel 3 and some one two three so you can read that and the quote is after failure empties your cup god's grace can fill the cup to its brim again what's a hope and so today's recipe is gobe yes you are going to have gobe in a daniel fast way so please do well to subscribe like this video and click on the notification bell for me and so i'm going to soak one cup of beans for like two hours yes so after two hours you are going to wash and then boil it yes so we already have boiling water on fire so while the beans is on fire we are going to work on our ingredients you are going to put all these together and blend them or grind them not very smooth yes so please if you are watching me and you have not yet subscribed consider subscribing like and share this video if you want to know what daniel fast is all about i'll leave a link in the description box for you to watch a video on it and also you can check the description box for a link to day one and day two okay so we have a, a pan on fire yes and we are adding our oil red oil uh -huh. gobe without red oil is not gobe and so just dropped in some chopped onions or sliced onions will allow it to um, stir fry a bit and then we are going to add the blended ingredients also to it and then give it time for it to cook yes So let's check on it so far yes and at this point we are going to add a uh, seasoning and we are using black and white pepper salt and dried thyme all these are natural seasonings no artificial as i said this is daniel fast so you cannot be eating artificial spices on daniel fast everything must be purely natural or organic do you get it mm -hmm. so let's check on our beans our beans is getting ready mm -hmm. it's getting ready yes and so at this point we can add salt to it i will just give it a little bit of water for it to cook more we've added our salt to it so we are going to cover and allow it to cook very well. We are going to add vegetables to this gobe. Yes. And so we have these vegetables we are going to stir fry a bit or in the oven. And so I'm going to add everything to my baking tray and sprinkle some um black and white pepper on it i wash this with salt solution yes so i will not add salt to it but i'm going to sprinkle a bit of white and black pepper on it and then i'll take it to the oven and then maybe a little bit of oil olive oil or coconut oil will do then i'll take it to the oven and um allow it to bake a bit just a little yes okay so our beans at this point is ready yes ready to be enjoyed so we will put it off and then allow it to cool and 
our vegetables to ready we've taken it from the oven and our red oil sauce too is ready yes the red oil sauce is ready and so this gobe we are not going to use gari you get it we are also going to make use of avocado we are going to make use of coconut flour not gari because i didn't want to eat too much carbs on the diet and so we are going to make use of coconut flour not gari so we are going to serve ourselves or i'm going to serve myself <laughs> When you add coconut flour to your cooked beans, it's just like you've added gari to it and the taste is awesome. You will love it, anka sankasa. So you try and give it a try. I have a video on how to make coconut flour at home. Or you can also buy some from other shops. Yes. And so this is it for today's recipe. Thanks so much for watching. Like this video for me. Click on the notification bell. Subscribe for me. Leave a comment as well. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.